Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome back to school. Hi, Mr. Presley here with you on Thursday, November 17th, 2022. We're glad you're back with us for a day of learning as we get started on this terrific, wonderful Thursday for learning. Hey, a couple of announcements for you. First of all, it is Native American Heritage Month. Have you been in the library and checked out the really cool display with all the books? There's some great books here. Look, uh, the Buffalo are back. That's a cool one. I love that one. The Girl Who Loved Wild Horses. That's an awesome one too. Bad River Boys. The Meeting of the Lakota Sioux with Lewis and Clark. Her Seven Brothers. Wow, that looks good. Storm Maker's Teepee. Those are some cool books. It is Native American Heritage Month. And so it's a chance for us to celebrate the families that we have at our school that are Native American and the Native Americans who have been in this area of Monroe for thousands of years. Um, even Seattle is named after Chief Self, Chief Self of the Duwamish tribe um, back in the 1800s. Um, so that's what Seattle is named after, Chief Self, who was a, a great leader for not only Native Americans, but um, just a great leader about the environment and how just humans, people, are just one part of the web of life. If you think about the web of all the plants and animals, that, that people are just one part of that web. Um, great story about Chief uh, Self. So Chief Seattle, or Chief Self, um, is one person in our community or area um, that made huge contributions to the Native American people and to the area that in which the greater area in which we live. Hey, you know what? I'm here today to with, oh, look who's here, it's Franklin. He's a Bigfoot. That's right, well, yeah, see, he's got big feet. He's Franklin. So Franklin is um, a Sasquatch or a Bigfoot, right? He's here with me today to share a couple of announcements. First of all, on our lunch menu today, we have, mmm, American classics, we have orange chicken, or you can have a ham and American cheese sandwich. There's roasted green beans, and remember to take a fruit and a vegetable with every school meal. Also today, Franklin and I wanna welcome and honor our police and fire department. That's right, today we are honoring and appreciating the blue and red, that's right. So did you wear your red and blue today? Red for our fire department in Monroe? and blue for our police department. That's right, those are called our first responders. Those are the men and women who serve and protect our community every day, and they are the first to respond when there's emergencies or things going on. We're gonna get a chance today, you and I and Franklin, we're gonna get a chance to honor those men and women who serve and protect us every day in our, in our Monroe community. All right, so um, they're gonna be coming this morning pretty early. Um, I hope you've got your signs made, you're wearing your blue for police, red for fire, and you're ready to uh, celebrate, cheer them on and say thank you for a great job that they've done. So just so you know, they're gonna come and do a little parade route through our school. It's a chance for us to cheer for them, clap for them, and say thank you. And then our staff have done a wonderful job. They've put together some treats and things for them. They'll be able to stop by the office area and enjoy some treats before they leave because we know they gotta get back to duty, right? They gotta get out there and serve and protect our Monroe community. So again, thank you Monroe Police Department, police officers, those men and women, and thank you Monroe Fire Department, those firefighters who are men and women serving and protecting our community. Hey, you know what? We got a couple birthdays to announce for today. Yeah, we do have two. Happy birthday today to Cadence Fisher and happy birthday to Eleanor Williams. So happy birthday to the two of you. You can come on down and pick out of the birthday bucket this morning. All right, boys and girls, let's have a great day of learning together. We learn together, we work together, and we do that by being kind, by helping each other out, accepting others. If you see someone with a problem, trying to see if you can help solve that with them or help them out, um, giving each other sometimes space. When somebody asks you to stop doing something, you stop doing it. Um, if you see somebody that needs help going in asking, hey, can I help you? Do you need something? That's the way that we share our kindness and love and understanding for each other every day at Frylands. So let's soar like Falcons do today and every day. Have a wonderful day, boys and girls, and always remember, Franklin in your Freilands family care about you. Teachers, please lead your students in the Pledge of Allegiance. We hope you have a chance to come check out 
the Native American Heritage Month books that Mrs. McBride has on display here. Let's visit the library and enjoy reading. Take care.